What are the losses that you've gone through? It actually starts back further than that. Um, our whole kids' life, it's just starting when our daughter was eight and our son was four. It just one by one, family members and friends started passing away, making death really real, something where we were faced with mortality. In January of 2021, our 18-year-old son was killed in a motorcycle accident. Yeah, and he was named Ryder. He was. Yeah. <laughs> Gary, Gary tell, tell me about your son, Ryder. Well, Ryder was pretty much a free spirit. Um, <laughs> he just loved life, lived life to the fullest. Uh, avid surfer uh, and water polo player. He was killed before his first water polo game in college. But he was just a very caring, loving kid who enjoyed life and lived it to the fullest. Martha, what, what went through your mind? I mean, going through a, a tragedy like that. In a strange way that's really hard to articulate, I yeah. feel like God was preparing me mm. um, for much of his life. Um, when I explain Ryder, I say he was full throttle. Um, he was pedal to the metal. He was full throttle joy, full throttle grief, full throttle um, crazy. Um, he just was always to the fullest. He was either doing something wild and enormous, whether it be caring for someone with special needs, or he was asleep. There was really no in between.